Hello there, Flo back here with another quick little video. Today I will be unboxing a few of the new LEGO video blind boxes. These released March 1st with the entire new wave of the video wave, which is kind of an, the new app gimmick stuff that LEGO has put out. I didn't really care for the app and also didn't buy any of those bigger boxes because 20 euros really seems a bit steep for those. So I'll probably get one when the price drops down, but I got four of these blind boxes which is definitely something new since you aren't able to fill these figures up like you do with the CFF so I'm definitely not going for the full series here also mostly because I'm not interested in the full series I think there are 12 different figures and like some of the ones I don't really care for like the ice cream guy like these animal characters my favorite is probably that shark guy so I really hope I would be cool if I could get him, but there are some other cool ones like that ghoul lady, also the cheerleader isn't bad, so there are definitely some nice ones. These retail for 5 euros here in Europe, 5 bucks probably in the US as well, uh, which is a fair price because you, you get one figure like your regular CMF, and CMFs have been pushed up to one, 5 dollars in the US, but they luckily stayed 4 euro here, so they stayed with the old price. And having 5 euros for this for basically one figure which is as detailed as a CMF plus free printed tiles I think is a fair price so the pricing on these is pretty okay like not as bad as some of those bigger boxes which are basically a glorified version of this but really expensive so yeah I grabbed 4 random ones to kind of get a little taste of the wave and we're just gonna start unboxing these and see which ones we're gonna get these are just taped together like some of the bigger sets let's see the first one we have is already someone i said i don't care about it's the ice cream guy so i'm gonna get this guy assembled and then we'll i'll probably go through all the boxes and then we'll look at them at the end so i'll get that guy assembled and i'll see you in a bit so I put together our ice cream guy and the figure itself does look nice because with all the different prints I really like the uh, leg print with that waffle design also some nice arm print but overall the character kind of looks like a Fortnite skin which isn't really appealing to me but I really do enjoy all these printed tiles which are all really unique and like something I'm also really interested in and some of these are really cool these are I think I'm pretty sure those interact with the app but that's something I'm probably not gonna never try out so just gonna enjoy the prints but you also get the little instruction manual kind of get a little stand built for all to put the figure on and all those printed tiles and you also get the collection sheet for all the figures as I said the shark guy is probably my favorite I also really like that guy and the genie as well Clearly that, that ghoul is nice as well, oh, the werewolf would be pretty cool too since I have missed out both the times they released that headpiece so hopefully I'm gonna be able to get one of those and with that we're gonna go into the second little box and I just got the box hopefully we're go not gonna get duplicates and looks like we have the cheerleader in here yep. so I'm gonna get her assembled and quickly you know what I'm just gonna open all the boxes and then assemble them all and then show you them at the end this one doesn't work it as well next up we have the cowboy guy which is pretty like one of the more boring ones in my opinion so not too great either so i'm hoping i'm gonna get one i wanted or i wanted the cheerleader so hopefully i'll have another good one with the last box right here hopefully no duplicate and it's another duplicate uh, that's one of the ones i don't care for so um not the greatest selection but let me get those assembled and I'll, I'll show you them close up so here we have all four figures assembled 
Uh, first we have the ice cream guy. Cool looking figure, but not really that interesting. My favorite of the bunch is definitely the cheerleader, and it's definitely one I wanted. Really love the leg piece on her. There's a lot of lots of candy theme with this wave. Like also the skirt has some sprinkles printed on it. First time getting these pom pom pieces for me since we have gotten quite a few cheerleader figures, but I never got my hands on any of them. So. But finally getting some of those pieces. Also I really like that Harley Quinn hair piece in those bubblegum colors kind of. So that's really nice. And I really love some of those printed tiles like the Spaceman one. Is that an Among Us reference? <laughs> God, that joke is so dead. But I really like these two. But the popcorn is pretty nice as well. Third we have that cowboy guy which... Definitely has some cool prints, but mm, is rather more of the generic and boring ones. But I do like as well like some of those prints. The scuba guy looks really cool. Also, he has a uh, blue sideburns and blue eyebrows, so that's really cool. That these figures are really colorful and unique, so that's something at least to appreciate. And these are the kind of the animal ones which I didn't really care for, but actually having this in hand. Even though I didn't really care for it, it's still a really great looking figure. Like, look at the detailing on that tail piece. Like, these are like 100% when you... Oh. Um, actually, the that guy is the only one with arm prints. I thought there was more arm printing, but overall, still a really nice looking figure. And the torso and legs still can work for a regular figure. And also, really nice printed tiles. I really like this kind of abstract looking one also his accessory is really cool with that light blue disc so still a cool looking figure really detailed but not one of my favorites uh, so yeah I was hoping for maybe one more I wanted but I'd definitely pick up a few more like another batch of for next time maybe and we'll see what we'll see which ones I get in there and see if I will buy some more but for now this is a pretty cool little introduction to the wave. Love the printed tiles and the figures. While not that interesting, some of them still have great detail and just look really cool. So yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up here and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.